Hey what up guys, it's Fish here, sorry I just moved my mic a little bit closer. Um, today I'm quickly just going to run through a bit of Mass Effect 3 multiplayer. Um, I'm going to show you all the customization you can do and in the next video I'll show you guys um, a bit of gameplay. Okay, so um, yeah, this is the multiplayer for Mass Effect 3, it looks pretty fucking awesome. I guess these are all the systems you can fight in and you may need to turn these green I guess maybe to say that you're winning in them or something like that to make have an awesome uh, story finish because they did mention that uh, multiplayer and single player will be connected so the more do you do in uh, multiplayer the better single player finish you'll have so I'll quickly just run through like, all the customization and shit like that so this is my character um, as you can see Jackie Fish he's a level 4 soldier I've played one game and leveled up quite a bit and you can read all his skills and shit I'll quickly run through his powers this is just a soldier's point of view so you've got adrenaline rush uh, con concussive shell and all these stuff um, so I've got some points to spend actually, so I could spend it, I guess fitness, to boost my health because um, that is very very vital. So let's expand this and then you get a screen like this and then you just level it up. And I don't think I can do that, oh I can actually. I'll level that up twice and then I'll level up maybe this. Um, I shall up, up, um, I'll upgrade concussive shells so I can actually um, have all my abilities. So yeah that's done now. You can see I've got all my abilities which is pretty cool. And it sort of says your health and shields over here, and I think that looks pretty goddamn cool. Okay, so now we're going to weapons. Weapons are uh, pretty customizable. If you haven't seen in the uh, single player demo, you can get attachments for it, so you can get different scopes, you can get different. Um, uh, you can get. I'm just trying to think what else you can get. Um, you can just get so much stuff for them. And if you can see here, look, I haven't actually unlocked anything for the assault rifle yet, but if you look um, for my SM or for my shotgun, actually, I've unlocked a barrel for it. Um, which increases the range and stuff and you can just uh, cycle through these and change them um, you can have the two attachments and obviously inc increases uh, the weight capacity I think this one just increases it just increases, I'm not even sure, well it increases accuracy by 30% which is pretty goddamn nice um, but obviously the more weapons you have it uh, reduces your speed and stuff like that um, so yeah that's weapons pretty much, appearance fully customizable, you can change colours um, I'm not quite sure, I don't think you can change what, uh, like if you're a soldier or not, um, maybe you can, I'm not 100% sure, but you need to uh, unlock um, bonus cards, and I'll get to that in a second to get all this shit, uh, so you can get secondary colours, patterns, pattern colours and lights, which is pretty cool, so you can have fully customisable armour, which will be awesome to get into, and these are your bonuses, so my weapon bonus, I only have one, but that makes my SMG uh, do... Um, Hold on, let me read that. It is a bit of damage boost. So if you're playing a hard mission, you can use one of these. So it's a bit like FIFA 12 when you an ultimate team, if you know what I mean. I think that's sort of what we're trying to create, which is very, very cool. You just sort of like, you can boost yourself. If you're doing a, a particularly hard uh, mission, maybe you're playing on gold mode, and you want to give yourself a better chance, you can click one of these, and uh, it will activate for, for the map. And you can do it for armor, and you can do it for um, ammo. I haven't quite got that yet, but that's pretty much what you can do. And you have like supplies, you have medigel, uh, you have missile launchers, which um, are good to take out the massive juggernaut things, um, uh, survival packs and thermal clips and stuff like that, which is very cool. And this is the store where you get them. So you have veteran recruit packs and veteran uh, packs, and these just give you um, all the stuff I just talked about. So these gives you better armor, better customization, better equipment, uh, more medi gel, stuff like that. So that's really, really awesome. Uh, it's very cool how I've done that. I like how I've done that. Um, it is very awesome. And then sort of the matchmaking system is at the moment you can't do, like, probably you can't invite friends at the moment, I don't think, maybe. I'm not quite sure. I'm sh no, I don't think you can do uh, change your team. Um, but, yeah, you can change the location. These, there's only two from the demo and around here. I guess you have to win in each sector. You think how many maps there's going to be? There's going to be a hell of a lot of maps because, look, that's just two in the Earth system and that's two. And I'm sure there's be plenty more. And I guess you have to win, like, battles in these and I'm not sure how it's going to change, whether it's going to uh, change, like you have to keep on winning on them to keep them or what, and that's going to be really exciting. And also you have challenges, bronze, silver and gold. I played on, uh, my one game was on bronze difficulty and that was pretty goddamn hard, uh, towards the end at least. At the beginning it was easy, I was running around just meleeing people because it's pretty cool and uh, yeah, that was pretty easy. But when it, when it got to the last mission and you had to get to the extraction point, that was fucking impossible. Literally, I think I must have died three or four times and my teammates carried me, but it was still very, very good fun and um, I'm really liking what they've, what they've added in this isn't an, like normally with games you expect the first attempt at multiplayer not to be too great but they've done well here and I'm really impressed so please do go ahead and click that subscribe button there's a single player demo on my uh, 
on my channel so please do check out that and uh, make sure you subscribe i'm going to be bringing you guys some multiplayer action uh, later um which should be pretty fun and yeah so fish out